the boat with Jeff and Porter's ultralight casting. I am using, hope you can see it, there you go, the Rapala UL rod. So 7 grams max, 4 piece. Uh, it's how short? 5.6, so it's a bit short, very sensitive. Using 4 pound line and 6 pound leader. So, there's the rod. Really nice action, really light. Really ultra light. Number one size snap. And since I'm going UL, I'm going to try the vibes later on. I could try it now. But first, I want to try the micro jig. It's just been a while. Oh. Alright, so 5 gram, one of my really old micro jigs. Actually, the last one I have. With one hook. Ugh. Yo, so before I start fishing, this just want to give you a little peek. This used to be where the over there that's Jeff casting, but that's where the lighthouse used to be. So everything's getting repaired and everything's moving post Odette. So this was the area we used to cast. So just trying it out little by little. We'll see how it goes. We will try it out little by little. I mean, area by area. All right, pretty exciting stuff. Getting to try the new Rapala four piece UL rod. It's been a while. Lights up, here we go. First cast. Oh, not bad. Not too far. But the action's there. Oh, it's been a while for me to really use pure UL. Oh, okay. Have some follows. First strike. Yup. What is this, Angel? What's that? Huh? They fight? Ah, uh, jig. First fish on UL. Why are you here in my side, na Jeff? <laughs> Why are you in my side, na? Wow, perfect release, huh? Wale na ta, Jeff? 
I'm good. So Nick is here also. <laughs> What's your setup, Nick? What's your setup? Uh, 500 with the new Rapala. A good Vespida. Try here, Nick. Where who go, Papa? Over in the left. Ooh. Look at these. Two FJ cruisers totaled. Take me back to a place where I felt at home. Take me back to a day when we weren't alone. Take me back to an age when the world felt small. Way back before we blew it all Take me back to a place where I felt at home Take me back to a day when we weren't alone Take me back to an age when the world felt small Way back before we blew it all Too many things going on I can't keep track of them all From people dropping a bomb To people putting up walls I feel like life is on haul Perception stuck in a vault I know that time can heal all But how much time till we fall It's awfully chilly outside When there's no shelter to hide When everything is a lie You'll find that out in some time But when the things on your mind Are all considered a crime Communication aside We'll all just fight till we die Is this an argument? Or just the start of it? Either way I I don't wanna be a part of it Can I just get some space? I don't have the heart for this I can't be picking up the pieces Fixing scars from this Is this an argument? Or just the start of it? I wanna drive away So I can be so far from it I wanna find a place Where no one breaks their promises Or maybe drown myself In something that is bottomless Take me back to a place Where I felt at home Take me back to a day When we weren't alone Take me back to an age When the world felt small Way back before we blew it all Take me back to a place where I felt at home Take me back to a day when we weren't alone Take me back to an age when the world felt small Way back Let's before go. we blew it all I know that things seem bad but they could be much worse There's always someone else who has a greater curse A greater thirst, a hunger, pain and mercy. Just find whatever you got and try to be thankful first I wanna feel again I need a couple friends I never really understood just how the story ends But I could feel it's tense Don't know the consequence The volatility of life, my only confidence Is this an argument? Or just the start of it? Either way, I don't wanna be a part of it Can I just get some space? I don't have the heart for this I can't be picking up the pieces Fixing scars from this Is this an argument? Or just the start of it? I wanna drive away so I can be so far from it I wanna find a place where no one breaks their promises Or maybe drown myself in something that is bottomless Take me back to a place where I felt at home Take me back to a day when we weren't alone Take me back to an age when the world felt small Way back before we blew it all Take me back to a place where I felt at home Take me back to a day when we weren't alone Take me back to an age when the world felt small Way back before we blew it all So, uh, gonna cut the video short because it's about to get dark. Didn't get any other strikes aside from that angel looking fish. Not sure what it's called. Uh, the rod on the other hand, I was very impressed with. It's very flexible. It's nice, do whatever action. Lure, what I use, the my favorite, the micro jigs and even the soft plastic. Of course, with the soft plastic, I had, uh, <laughs> two sizes of the jig heads one was a uh, 2.5 and one was four I was more comfortable with the four because I could feel when I hit the bottom so it was a lot better but overall I really like the rod it's a bit short but because I have four pound line and with the right weight like maybe three to five it's max seven grams so three five grams it goes pretty far it's not because it's short you can't cast far of course it's not the farthest cast but it's really good enough unlucky to get the strikes so nice to be in porters again it's crazy what happened but it's nice to see the place slowly recovering and i don't know we just got to find fish uh maybe ask for help for the people come here a lot 
I heard it's open again to the public. Uh, see what's up. The fish are there. It's not the same. Maybe because of the uh, the construction and they're filling. They're reclaiming a bit of the piers. So when right over like over there. So you can still see the water's murky from the rocks and everything. The new ecosystem hasn't really stabilized yet. But the fish are still here. There still is fish, but it's still not like before where you'd see kudas jumping, a bunch of bait fish. Maybe it's the wrong time. But the sunsets still are pretty good. That hasn't changed for sure. All right, that's it for me. I'm going to check on Jeff and Nick, see if they caught anything. But I doubt it, because I didn't hear any screams. <laughs> Later!